Hi everyone, welcome to Peacock Way, welcome to my channel. Today I am making this mixed media project dedicating to all those brave strong people of Ukraine. My daughter-in-law is Ukrainian. I pray for strength and peace. I hope their fight for freedom will be successful. I also um, made this project with Ukraine on my mind. So I picked the colors from their flag um, that is uh, blue and yellow. So in this project I'm using this stamp uh, for the focal point and the stencil along with that uh, I'm using this text stamps for the background then uh, I'm using some of these other stamps um, also from uh, part of it but not all the stamps so I'll be using all these for the project um, then uh, along with that I'll be using this die uh, which I already uh, cut it and this is like a hexagon shape and I'm going to be using that also in the project so let's continue in keeping the ukrainian people in our thoughts and prayers so i'm using this acrylic inks uh, blue and yellow for the background i'm going to put some drops on the watercolor paper uh, and i'm going to spray water and spread it out I'm adding some more drops to make it like a little um, concentrated and then I'm spraying water. I want that uh, rich blue color. Then uh, once it gets uh, all over the page then I'm going to um, use yellow color on the sides I'm trying to be careful so uh, I won't mix yellow and uh, blue because then it turns out green so I am trying to carefully uh, blend and keep the yellow as pure as possible now i'm going to let it dry i'm using my heating gun to dry it i'm trying to give little bit of shade using my 
brown uh, neo color I'm spraying some water and blend it and then I'm putting again a um, blue acrylic and then darkening it little bit in some areas Then I'm adjusting with the neo color. Now I'm going to dry again everything. I just have to use this brown to blend everything together so now I'm going to let everything dry I'm just uh, scribbling those colors Then I'm going to dab this uh, hexagon uh, paper. going to dry all these elements also then I'm going to give a little bit of yellow color in that Now that elements are ready, I'm going to put the text stamp on that. Then I'm also using um, some of the stamps to give some extra texture on that. I'm using blue archival ink 
uh, for that. Now for the background, I'm going to use this gesso. I'm just lightening those edges. Now I'm going to cut this uh, stamp which I'll be using as the focal point. So I'm going to trim all those excess paper. I'm just trying to see uh, which side I have to cut more. Now I'm putting this uh, stencil and I'm using this white and uh, light blue in that mixed. And I'm going to use my sponge and dab on the stencil to give some extra texture on the background. using this text stamp for the background then I'm using this uh, kind of like a stone stamp
using uh, neo color crayons for coloring the focal point now um, all the coloring is over so now I'm going to place it and see how I can keep all together and then now I'm sticking all pieces together Now I'm going to stick the uh, focal point Now I'm going to uh, give some shading
I'm using a yellow color crayon and then I'm using my brush to blend it Now I'm going to color the edges using uh, Neo Color Crayons. Now that uh, the edges are ready, uh, I am uh, using white uh, pen uh, to put like a dots on the uh, background. The white pen was not working very well so I am using Posca pen now. Now I am uh, doing some shading for the uh, focal point, outside the focal point. I am again using Neo Color crayons. Now that everything is done, I am putting the coat. Uh, I am putting the coat as love. And uh, underneath uh, I have uh, used my label maker and typed the words uh, saying the world needs more so uh, this finishes my project um, let's continue in keeping the Ukrainian people in our thoughts and prayers and I pray for strength and peace thanks for watching I will see you in my next video thanks bye